Here we are with another video for Adobe XD. This time we will talk about creating a mask. While using Adobe XD, your mask can sometimes unmask itself or you can create a new mask from scratch. Using keyboard shortcut shapes and other methods are available for achieving this. Using shapes. Let's say we want a picture inside a shape. Using any of the geometric shapes or the pen to draw a shape, drag and drop an image inside the shape. You can manipulate the photo's position or size by double clicking on it. Using keyboard shortcuts or through the menu, Let's say I have an image that I would like to mask with a shape. From the toolbar, let me create a shape. You can step both an image and a shape by doing a marquee selection or selecting the shape first and holding the shift key to add the image to the selection. Next, let's use the keyboard shortcut, command shift M on a Mac or control shift M on a PC. Another method is choose object and mask with shape from the menu. You can also right click the mouse, scroll down until you see mask with shape. Using Photoshop or other photo editing software is another trick. Using Photoshop will give you mockups a different look. In this photo, I want the hand and the phone to be cut out of the background. Using the quick selection tool, I click on select subject and add mask. Make sure everything is selected by zooming in. Photoshop missed a little bit of the sides here. Zoom in and use the brush tool to paint back in that area. Then I go to the menu, image, trim, so I can get rid of all the transparent pixels and then file save as as a transparent PNG. Because I use Photoshop to mask out the background, I can then drag and drop this into my XD file. It's possible to add a color or texture background behind this new transparent image. So that's how a few different ways in Adobe XD to mask your design. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please like it and subscribe to get more tips and tricks.